Hey, how's it going, everybody? It's your pal and possible. I'm here, and we're back in final upgrade, and we got our ships ready here. Uh, let's just go to war real quick, you know? Let's just, like, knock out a battle real quick. So, uh, what do we want to hit? We're running out of our, uh, yellow targets to hit, honestly. Uh, and they're running a little low. Hey, right, let's head over here. I, I went ahead and I, uh, I claimed some of these other territories that we took the last couple episodes. I think we'll head over here and knock these guys out real quick before we get into our main build section of the episode. And I think this last um, update made it so you can have more than six ships at a sector, which means we're not limited to just bringing three into here, being they already have three ships. One, two, three, and then also a station. So I think that was taken out this last update on the public uh, you know, build. I'm not 100% about that, but we'll find out really soon. So let's get our, uh, I'm going to use uh, this functionality here to bring them all in, if I can find them. If not, meh, stuff happens. Uh, we'll get probably cannon fodder in here. I guess I'll have him start jumping. Do I have time going? Okay, we'll stop there for a second. I'll have the other ones all port starting from now. Alright, probably cannon fodder is already hyper jumping. And we need, I think these are my new ships. Let me double check. Are these my new ones? Which one are you? What's your name? Work. All right, I need my workhorses. We're definitely going to go with the workhorses to get them over there. I just Jim and just Sam are uh, I, what I renamed to these ones here. The non-gold workhorses. So that's just Sam. This is just uh, Jim. We'll get them after they, we get the workhorses over here. So let's get this. I think we're attacking this one? Nope. I think we're attacking this one. I hope we're attacking this one. Let's get the uh, workhorses. I think we're all the way down here. Yep, get those going. And uh, I'll give it a minute, let these guys start porting over. And I think the game auto pauses now when battle starts. In fact, let me double check. I think it's something you can set in options. I'm not 100% about that. Uh, auto pause in battle, good. All right, so when battle starts, it'll auto pause us, hopefully. So I don't have to do that manually anymore. I was I always worried about it, like have to click the button as soon as possible. But no, that's no longer a thing. So we have our uh, probably cannon fodder, our capital sh uh, ship, workhorse, golds, both of them. And we'll also get just Sam and just, uh, just I can't remember the other one's name, just Sam and just Jim. There we go. We'll get both of those coming over here. And if, if these all show up here, we did not auto-pause like I wanted it to. Okay, I don't know why it didn't, but it did not. Anyway, so we, we've already lost half of our ships. Because, you know, that's just what happens when you're running at 4x and they get five shots off before you do anything. Anyway, let's start shooting at things. So uh, with rail guns, which is what these things have, you can't just shoot off these little objects here. You have to actually kill things because rail guns don't hit uh, the floor one. They only hit floors uh, two, uh, two and three. So just so you know, just throwing that out there in case people are wondering why I'm just not just trying to snipe off this little area here. It's because it doesn't work with rail guns. That's just how it works. So we're going to go ahead and see if we can shoot this stuff up right here. But the upside of that is, means this, this guy can shoot way over here. And I don't have to worry about him hitting this stuff here, because he'll shoot right through it. And I don't think this guy will reach anything. Yeah, he can't reach anything from here. I think I'm just going to have to go ahead and move him. Let's go ahead and local jump. This is going to suck that I'm going to have to do this, but... It is what it is. We'll local jump him over here. And we'll, let, we'll bring it down to 1x speed. So I'm not, like, freaking out over here. We should get our other ships in soon, hopefully. Oh, we got those all blown up over here. Let's have everyone train on this one right here. This thing ought to blow up really quick, honestly. I wish I could have all of them fire at that instead of just having them fire at the core. Like, if I could just click here and say fire at that. Oh, can I do that? I can have the whole ship fire at that one thing? I was, I was pretty sure they just fire at the core, but I could be wrong. Let's watch. Where do you fire at? Oh, they took it out. All right, that works. So this thing is done. I still want this ship to move, but it's not yet. I don't think these... Can these reach all the way out here? Some of them can. Like, maybe you do a little bit of damage from there. Not much. This thing is definitely still going to be hitting us. Can you hit at that at all? Not really. You can try, but yeah, you're not going to do much from here. I'm going to let it go for a second, but yeah, they're not really doing much from there. They can't really reach. Alright, what's this? Oh, oh, we got a gun over... Oh, we got guys up here now. 
Alright, they poured it in without me knowing, unfortunately, but that's okay. Uh, well, if, since we can... Let's, let's split up our shots a little bit here. You go there, you go there, you hit these two, like that. And these guys just split up their shots a little bit. I have these two go after this one. This one go after this one. All three go after that one, actually. There we go. Uh, these guys I'll have poured over after the big behemoth here ports. Because, uh, God forbid, they get in the way. Yeah. Let me see if I can move these guys a little bit closer somehow. Maybe, uh, I don't know. I kind of just want them out of here, to be honest. I don't think I need them, need them to be here. Uh, Alright, let's just start hitting stuff. This guy hasn't got a chance to hit, like, anything yet. So, you, just, you know, just blow stuff up, buddy. Just go to town on these guys. And let me see here. Can you reach? Yeah, you can reach. Okay, you do that, and you start shooting at that guy. And uh, you, you haven't shot anything up here, I don't think, yet. So you just do your thing. And these guys, I, they can't reach anything. I don't think... I think I'm just going to port these guys out of here. They can, they can go on home. They're not doing me much good where they are right now, anyway. And by the time they port, the, the fight's going to be over. So there's, like, no real point. All right, let's, let, let's wa watch this keep going. Oh, we got that destroyed over here. This thing is down. We can start firing down here. The whole front of this guy's ship is ate up. And for some reason, I just love it. I don't even care. All right, you shoot all that there. I don't think you can shoot at anything from here, can you? Try to shoot there. We'll see what happens. Okay, he shoots in that direction. He doesn't get very far. Oh, he, he took him out. He, he actually he was able to aim there. I was surprised. I didn't think he'd be able to shoot that far. All right, we'll keep shooting here, buddy. I think we took out most things here. Can you, you want to keep shooting and killing these things down here? I just like shoot in that direction. There you go. You know, maybe we should shoot at the thing and it can actually hurt us. It probably makes more sense. This one's out of battery, so it can't shoot anything. So we'll actually shoot at that one. There we go. We'll figure it out one of these days. We're doing pretty good, actually. That thing will die pretty soon. It's got to go at some point. We're shooting at it with, like, everything. All right, once you, once you, you know, shoot there. That's where we're shooting. Go go to town. You know what? You shoot there, too. Everyone's shooting right there. Right at that one gun. We'll get it eventually. It'll happen. It has to happen eventually. Right? All right, we, we destroyed the core before we ever got there. And, of course, we followed the wrong ships out of there. That's all right. Where are we at? We're... Where the heck are we? We're right here. Okay. So we took it over. We killed everything. There, there's no capturing anything. We just killed everything. That's just how we roll, baby. All right. So uh, we definitely don't have a ship limit anymore, which helps us a lot. It means we can just swarm things. Apparently, we finished a work order. What did we do? We finished a titanium shell work order, so we got stuff for that. Got lots of EXP for that. Uh, let's go ahead and send this guy home. You know what? I'm gonna yeah. I'm just gonna send all these guys home. Jump the sector. You go there. Jump the sector. You go there. And jump the sector. You go there. That's all of them. And hopefully it'll be okay. I'll I'll go and heal. You know, let's go claim this area real quick. Let's go fill this guy up with. He probably has enough on him to be honest. But we'll fill him up real quick. Go claim that area. Make sure they don't have any ideas about getting it back. So wait, let's go. Yeah, let's let's bring the speed up here again. Got to have it down low. All right, let's head on over there. Get this cleaned up. There we go. It's all ours now, buddy. Y'all can't do nothing about it. There we go. So, uh, we have to we have to do lots of repairs and yada yada yada. I, I guess I could start doing them at least a little bit. I'll bring this guy over. Who's the most hurt? Like, who's I, maybe this guy's the most hurt? I don't know. We'll bring them over here. We'll bring them to the uh, warehouse and start getting them healed up one at a time. But we're, not, you know, me and you are not going to focus on that. The game is going to have to focus on that while we're doing other cool things. So let's go ahead and local jump this one. I wish this ship would move. Why don't you get the heck out of here? I don't know what you're doing, but you know what? You're in the way. I want this because all my robots are right here. So I'd rather them, you know, be able to do things. Let me pause it up real quick. Uh, restore from blueprint. Why didn't move it over there? I, I moved you on purpose. No, whatever. Whatever game. Whatever. Okay, so now our robots are going to go take care of that. This guy, is he a liquids trader? What's he do? He's a liquids carrier. Let's go ahead and put him back on his liquids carrier route. 
Uh, yeah, harvest liquids. There you go, buddy. I, uh, I displaced them, so I figured I'd put them back. And now we have things we have to do. Let's go find us a good open sector, first of all. Maybe, like, over here. Do we have anything here? Doesn't look, this is kind of like an unused sector, so I guess we'll use this spot right here. So anyway, we have a bunch of things we still don't have the capability of making. Uh, one of them being steel, uh, no, not just plates, uh, not just steel plates. Steel plates is what I was about to say. Uh, just plates in general, you know, the steel, nickel, ferro, titan, you know, all these different tape, uh, plates that we need for all sorts of builds that we've been making locally. Uh, it'd be nice if we could make all of them in one place, in one, like, factory of sorts. So I figure we'd get that knocked out, and maybe, uh, maybe consumer electronics, which is something I've been wanting to do forever, and I just don't. Anyway, let's just start this one up. We'll call it Plate Factory. There we go. And uh, these ought to be pretty easy. Could it, basically, you take in two metals and you output a plate of some sort. That's uh, basically how these work. So let's go ahead and get a template up of some sort. We can fix this as we go. And then we should be able to just copy and paste over and over as we want, essentially. Uh, I think it's a fabricator for plates. I could be wrong. We'll check momentarily. What do you need, good sir, to make the different plates of wonderfulness? Do we have a... I don't think we have a thing for plastic plates either, do we? We might, we might, we might not. You know what? Plastic plates we probably have in the circuit factory, now that I think about it. So let's just move on to steel plates, ferro titan plates, and gold plates. And if we need different plates, we could put those in there too. But I'm pretty sure we have plastic plates in with the circuits factory. So let's do that. All right, this one needs ingots, iron, and nickel. What's this one need? Ingots, iron... That's what I just clicked. Fair Titan, what do you need? Ingots, iron, and titanium. And this one, titanium and gold, probably. Yeah, there we go. So uh, let's just do like three of them. Three, uh, three fabricators per material. And uh, let's see, we're gonna need probably more space than I normally give them, to be honest. So uh, let's let's add a little bit more space up top. Like We can move the bottom part down because we don't need that much space down at the bottom, if I'm being honest. You know, it just, we just don't. Unless I want to have a massive repository of it. Because there's nothing wrong with, honestly. Alright, let's get the outputs here. Because we know we're going to want to take the goodies out of here. And we'll go like this. These are all going the exact wrong way. Because why wouldn't they be? Let's copy that one and we'll just have them all work the way we want here. Now we need two spaces. Two uh, resource zones. This one's going to be iron and nickel. And I've been told that I don't make my resource zones big enough. So we shall rectify that. Prepare for the rectification. It shall be happening. So there we go. There's iron uh, iron ingots. This is going to be a demand zone right here. And we're making another zone right here. This is going to be nickel ingots. Right here. There we go. That's up. Oh, put that back up. And we need demand zone here. Now we're just going to set up the same basic uh, setup we normally have for this. We catch it, you know, the stuff coming in from right here, come down and go over like this, and then down. And then we just have to fit some uh, ju uh, tube joints in here. So we're gonna have a tube joint there, tube joint there, throw these in here. That's how we're gonna connect to the other part. Let's see if I can get this part right here fixed up. So I'm not gonna want you to connect there or there. And we'll have all these set up the same way, so we'll copy this one and run that one over. Just so we make less of a mess later, essentially. Let's make all these so they don't connect from the top. Will uh, save us some time by doing that, honestly. So let's copy that one and run it all the way over. There we go. And uh, they, they still want to go down in at least, you know, one spot over each machine. So there we go. Alright, now we just basically want the same exact thing, but like copy it the other way. And let me see here, where do we stop? Oh, I actually don't want it. If this is going to be the end of our area, I kind of don't want us to continue our zones that way. I might have gone too far with our zones here, but we're, we're going to bring it back a little bit. Let's adjust this zone a little bit. Like, you know, like here-ish. I guess we'll go there. In this zone, I'm going to have to delete it to make it do the thing I want, unfortunately. That's just how it, that's just how it do sometimes, unfortunately. Let's get this one here, nickel ingot, as soon as I see it, there we go. And we're going to start it from here, I think. Like that. Yeah, that brings it right to the wall, that's pretty much how I want it. So for, uh, we'll extend it down a little bit, not add. 
band. There we go. Go down one. Come on. There you go, game. You figured it out. Let's go ahead and uh, delete this one. No, no. All right. Sometimes the game just wants to do things the way it wants to do. There we go. I want the zone up so we can actually see what we're doing now. So basically, we're going to copy this and do the exact opposite way, essentially. So you're going to run down here. I could do things differently than how I'm doing them, but I'm not going to. <laughs> essentially, we're going to go like this, and then run it on over. And down right there. And this one can just go down to right there like that. Now we just have to fix this up a little bit. Just a little bit. Or a lot of bit. It could be a lot of it. We can get rid of the zone now, so we don't see that. Let's turn this one off, that one off. There we good. Have these ones so that it, they don't feed down. Copy that here and run it all the way over. There we go. You don't feed to the right, but you feed down. Sorry about the world's most annoying car in the background. If I could get rid of them from this planet, I would probably. No, okay, I'm just a little, little frustrated. They just drive by while I'm recording all the time, and it's quite frustrating. But I'm sure you guys, uh, I'm sure you guys can forgive me if if you look very very hard into the bottom of your hearts, you'll find a place to forgive me for their loud cars. I have no power over them. Hopefully, I can uh, you know edit them out. But we'll see if I remember if the processing gets them out and so on and so forth. Anyway, now that we've gone through all that, we'll set this up as the man zone, and do do do. All right, and we just have to set these up as a steel plate zone. That works. Let's go ahead and copy this machine and run it over here. And that's it. We have an official steel old plate factory. Uh, we're just basically going to have to... Uh, well, we're going to separate it with a wall of some sort. So let's go ahead and put a tier 2 wall here. Did I not? Come on. Work with me, game. There we go. Oh, I'll just make a mess here. That's how I roll. Don't worry about it. Uh, delete this mess I made over here. And I can't get rid of the last one because it's the only thing still holding things together. That's fine. That's fine. We could leave it there. Let's go ahead and uh, basically this is what we want. I mean, we could put a... For right now, I'm just going to copy it as it is. And we're just going to copy this two more times, I think. Let's go ahead and get that going. Let's do something like that. And can I throw you right here? Yep, that works. One more time. Oh. That's not what I wanted. I wanted an extra space there. Mistakes were made. Mistakes were made. All right, let's get rid of this one little thing here. There we go. We'll just have to... I wish I could just copy it exactly the same way I just had it. Oh, we'll copy it one more time. I'll have to try to make sure I, I have space for a wall there. Why is it not... Oh, I don't have a wall there. That's That's entirely my fault. I didn't have the wall over here when I copied it. Okay. I repeated the same mistake again then, apparently. That's on me. Let's get rid of this. Let me put, I'm going to want the wall here anyway, so I might as well just throw it there. I then copy it, and now I'll actually have it when I put the wall up. All right, we should actually have a wall on the bottom too, now that I'm looking at it. It would be a good idea. Yeah. Don't mind me as I make a mess everywhere, all over the world here. There we go. Plug that. Just plug that hole. Plug it. Right there. Hello, game. There's a hole there. I see it. Plug it. Like, what? Why don't you want to get rid of that hole for me? Let's see if they'll let me do it now. Yeah, I don't know. It was really weird. They really did not want me to plug that hole. I don't know why. That was kind of weird. But we got it plugged. We worked hard enough. Eventually things happened. Alright, let's go ahead and get this two-tier hole plugged up there. Run a line up the side here. There we go. That's essentially what we want. Yeah, now we just have to copy this wall over here like I tried to a million times before. And this time I don't want that wall. I think I still got it. It doesn't, in the grand scheme of things, it doesn't matter whatsoever, but it's like it would bother me if I did. There we go. Let's just plug up the side here. Like so. And we should be set. We just have to set up the uh, zones and the machines and everything. That's fine. Let's make a little space for the batteries here. Uh, we'll just throw down. That did not do what I wanted it to do at all. They shouldn't even built half of those, I don't think. All right. 
Let's try that again. I'll shift click this time. I swear I know how to do things sometimes. There we go. We'll throw that down. We'll throw down some batteries just so that we have power to get this station going. Something like that. It'll never... Uh, I built things in a way where it'll never be even. The internet's gonna hate me forever. <laughs> okay. Are, are we all set up? I think we're kind of mostly set up. I've been on a little bit of a rant this episode, haven't I? Alright, I think we're good. I'm gonna go ahead and get the zones set up. Uh, these have to be set up. Uh, you know, this will be... Uh, let me see. This will be Titan and uh, Iron, I think. This will be Gold and Titan. And then I have to set up all the machines and the zones and stuff, blah, 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 blah. I'll be back in just a moment after I have that all set up. Alright, I'm back. I have all the zones and machines set up. Let's double check that they work in the simulation real quick. I'm a big fan of this simulator, by the way, and it does seem to be working. Luckily, none of our stuff is falling off into space, so we seem to be working good there. Let's go ahead and get this thing built. Yep, build it out of there. That's fine. Throw it down here. We're going to call it the... Mm, I guess we're just call it the plate station. I mean, it's kind of just what it does. There, you make plates. No, I'm not going to have them build it. We're going to make use our own builders. We have awesome builders. We might as well just use them. Here we go. Make it so, builderinos. Let's get them on this. Have all these guys queued up to get this done really quick. There we go. I will time lapse through this really quick, and I will be right back. All right, there we go. We got our stuff all set up here. Let's go ahead and send all our ships back to somewhere out of the way. I like being able to use this new. You know, just do this from range, summon them wherever the heck you want. That's kind of awesome. Uh, we're plate station up here. Okay, let's start getting our, uh, you know, zone set up for here. We know we're going to need iron ingots. We're going to be getting that from here. We're going to need titan ingots, which we'll get everything from here, essentially. This is our make things into ingots zone, so that's just kind of how that works. So gold ingots, we'll also be getting from there. Shove it over here. And that should be everything we need is this functioning is it doing things why why is you not doing things you're set up right yeah I've, i have it set up do we have not have not no it's not set up because i didn't actually set up nickel and get to come there so it is all my fault why that is not going yet all right do you get nickel ingots do you need nickel ingot things do you make the steel happen this steel is happening there we go Oh, just to answer some of these uh, questions from last episode, they said they wanted an add-on so that we could make, I think it was Zach who said this, they wanted an add-on so we can make uh, steel shells for our uh, rail guns. The uh, second tier ammunition is actually steel shells. It goes iron, steel, electro steel, and then uh, titanium and gold, uh, titanium gold composite. So there you go. So no add-on required. You get steel shells right off the bat. That's just tier two stuff. And uh, I think this is a good place to end this one here. I'm going to have to do a lot of repairing off, off recording and stuff for get us ready for our next episode, but that's okay. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this. This game is Final Upgrade. If you guys are interested, I have a link down in the description for you to check it out for yourselves. If you guys are new to this channel, it's what I do. I play any games every single day on the internet for your enjoyment. Play some base building automation games, vehicle engineering games, tower defense games. And uh, actually, I just started playing Autonauts on the channel, so if you guys are into this, you might be into that. You might want to check that out. So uh, if you guys are into this kind of stuff, once you hit that subscribe button, click that bell icon so you know how to put up new content, smash that like button, leave a comment down below. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.